Um, hi, this is Maria from Adonis Fertility International, and I am talking today with Ivana Lesek. Ivana is our Chief Patient Coordinator. Um, and what I was hoping to do is give you a little bit of a glimpse of what her and her amazing team are doing. So Ivana, would you share just in a couple of words, uh, what does it mean to be Patient Coordinator? Uh, hi to everyone. Um, what does it mean? I think it means to be very responsible, to be ready to provide any um, help, any support at every moment of your life. And of course, to be patient, because uh, there are many, many difficult uh, or easy um, cases, but still uh, for patients, nothing can be easy. And they are nervous, they are scaring, they are... Um, they have some doubts, they have a lot of questions. And of course, the most important is to give all this information in a proper way, uh, in the term 24 for seven, and uh, of course, to provide all the uh, information to the patient in a proper way with uh, no white blinks, you know, with no, uh, some hidden, so we never, um, we never hide something, we never uh, stop to answer, and we always provide the information. Uh, even if patient uh, doesn't ask, <laughs> we still give um, all the info, all details, all cases, all the information, statistics, and so on. And uh, of course, it is very important um, coordinator. It is not a profession for everyone. Uh, not everyone can become coordinator, not everyone can um, be in so emotional stress all the time because uh, you it is a responsible work, people are living uh, not just close to you and you must explain everything in a proper way um, at, during the day, during the night, it doesn't depend are you celebrating your birthday or are you sleeping, <laughs> it, doesn't, uh, it doesn't mean, you know, for the patients his time is the perfect time to call you and to talk with you. Mm -hmm. But still, it is not a problem. Of course, everyone from my team understands what we are talking about, why we are talking about, and what is the aim for what we work. Mm. And, um, and so you have, um, how many people you have on your team? Uh, 20. 20 persons working in international department. Okay, just international department. And um, and you yourself, you have been with Adonis for how many years? Seven. Seven years. And so what also, what brought you here? What is your dream? Uh, my dream, I would like to say, um, almost uh, came true because I become a mother. And, uh, you know, I worked with Adonis even before uh, my pregnancy, but... Um, uh, when I got this child, I understood that uh, even because I understood very much patient, but still I um, I should say that uh, after I got the baby, I understood how much and how important it is. And uh, I think and I'm confident in this that uh, parenthood, it is not a wish, it is not a dream, it is not uh, something, you know, that you just think that you, maybe you should have it. It is a right, mm. and every person uh, should become parent. Every person should feel this happiness, and it is a right that you can have your baby. And of course, the donors and all my team, all our doctors are working for this aim to provide this right to be completed mm. and to have a healthy baby in your yeah. family. And of course, in a proper way, and uh, as much as it is, as it is just uh, possible to provide your journey easier, comfortable, and no stressful. It is the biggest aim of all our work, as for me as well, of course. Wow, wow, I love it. And I also love what you're talking about, that your team and you literally, you guys available 24 seven, because I have experienced that with you. Um, at any moment where our patients here from the United States have any questions, you guys have been so flexible and so responsible and so available that you don't even notice that, um, you know, we're working with someone um, on, a, on another side of the world. So thank you so much for creating this uh, wonderful environment and experience. Thank you. 
not at all. Not at all. <laughs> this is our the biggest aim, and I believe that uh, I am very agree I agree with our chief of reproductology department that uh, there is no uh, absolute infertility. Uh, so still variants exist. The most important is to contact with fertility specialists and to ask what chances you have, what variants you have, and I'm sure that the donors can find this variant under the law, under the proper way to provide the success. Mm, well, thank you so much. All right. <laughs> we'll speak later. Okay. Bye-bye.